Fidel Castro. What? Yeah, what is that? Italian? Spanish? Look here you are, Trevor. Ah, oh, but ain't my favorite marksman, huh? How are you, Cletus? Fine and dandy, sir. You ready to hunt some elk? Ah, uh, beat satellite dishes. <laughs> Lead the way. Oh, here you go. Now, uh, put this in your mouth. A bad day hunting still beats a good day working, my pa always used to say. Where do you find happiness? Ah! Oh, come on! There, there. I know this is weird for all of us. You're gonna make a batshit crazy lady very happy. It's not... I always enjoy meeting people more chemically unbalanced than myself. Northbound on um, Jamestown Street. <laughs>
sakes. See the pump. We're in pursuit.
virtually naked. Well, never. There you are, hmm? Jock. Yeah, I got you that stuff. Oh, great. Where's your wife? Mrs. Thornhill, she's mm. not my wife. She's got a husband and two lovely kiddies at home. We met online. It's no, nothing sexual. Where is she? Well, she's been trying to throw herself under celebs wheels. <laughs> no, no, she can throw herself under my wheels anytime. Oh, <laughs> I knew you were funny, John. Yeah. I knew I would like you. Can I have a hug? Okay. I've got a protruding hip. It's not a semi. Nigel! John! No. You won't believe what's happened! What? Only Alden Appley walking. He actually walks! He walks walk among, among us! Well, then what are you freaks waiting for? Well, that's a long story. Of mistaken identity. And a lot of lies. Stalking is not what I would call it. Not me! I told the judge I thought it was unfair. Yes, anyone's trousers could have come undone at that point. Exactly. Jolly bad luck, and we were such fans. If only we could talk to him. Yes, I know it was only his lawyers and agents. They ruin everything. If we could only get him somewhere private. You see, like that little lockup, I know. No problemo. Look, there he is! Oh, shit. It's that crazy English bitch again. Nigel, he remembers me! To the chariot! Jock, you drive. Quick, he's getting away! Come on, Jock, get in! He's taking a left turn down the high street, Jock! Did you ever imagine we might get a private audience with Al Di Napoli? Only in my wildest dreams! Bolo's nights spent role-playing in Mother's utility room. If only we'd known! I loved him in The Redeemer. Oh, Nigel, do your Al Di Napoli line! This is turban warfare, motherfucker! <laughs> it's a penny! <laughs> oh, dear! Poor Jock must think we're back. The higher car! Oh! Stop shooting! I can't hear myself think! I hear that behind his charitable public face, he's remarkable. Oh, my word! Jock! Do you see that lorry? What the fuck's a lorry? Have a little faith! Anyone would think this was my first kidnapping. What on earth will we feed the man? I... Maybe I should have driven... I hadn't even thought of that. He probably will never get that deposit back. He probably eats sushi or quinoa. Is that even how you say it? What if? Find out! He's going into the car park! The car park! No worries, mate! Oh, I hope he likes us! How could he not? This lockup you prepared sounds charming! Just be yourself, Mrs. Thorne. Oh, my giddy aunt! Everything okay there, Earl Crazy Cakes? My prostate has taken quite a beating. You have to lower the tone. Glad to see you on the proper side of the road. This must be second nature to you, Jock. All those stunts you used to do. This level of derangement? I'm impressed. Little by little, I'm... Is he going through the hospital? Oh, my lord! Hold on to your corsets! Uh, seems rude not to follow him through the window. Bloody hell! Such a thrill! Ah, uh, would you like me to escort your guest of honor to the trunk? Well, if you don't mind. Oh, come here, you. Come on. Come on. Let me meet your biggest fan. Oh, ah. no. You're fucking crazy. Oh, it's Get off me. Uh. You 
We're good to go. Ah, a true gentleman. This is so exciting. Nut jobs. Lucky miss! A reckless driver on Prosperity Street in the Spishy Canal.
kidding me? Out of my way. Hey, what's going on, brother? <laughs> Step on back, dude. Hey, asshole. Watch it. Dog fucker. Get <laughs> ready for the hot damn. Let's party, gentlemen. Oh, he's making such a fuss, these celebs. Oh, they're not like you or me. Ah, ah apart from you, Jock. <laughs> Would you go and get him one of his favorite pizzas? No. Well, then I don't know what to do with him. I mean, he hasn't eaten for a few days. You've kidnapped a major movie star, okay? Now, you can either leave him somewhere and hope he's been sufficiently scared shitless to stay quiet, or you can send him on the kind of trip he won't come back from. Oh, a trip! Such fun! Oh dear, oh dear, what a palaver this is! Decisions, decisions! If you could just handle this, Jock... Mm. 
Al is in the boot of the car. You'd be doing us such a favor. I'm really not one for goodbye. He's doing. Well, it's a very big decision. Oh, what are you doing? you from A to B. Uh, a being the trunk of this car and B being a horrific scenario of my choosing. Oh God, please no. I, I, I have money on me. Lots of money. Good to know. Well, good to know. I'll be sure to grab that after we're done. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Please let me go. I thought you were a big tough action movie guy. Movie critics. What are those crazy old bricks with you? Just me and you, honey bun. Jeff, fun with those two? They're harmless, aren't they? They are not harmless. Those fucked up parlor games. The things that woman may be due to her feet. Ah, you lucky boy. Older women are to be cherished. Like a fine cheese. Sometimes the rind is the best bit. What do you want? Cars? Drugs? What about art? I, I got shit loads of art. I know you wouldn't want that. You barely know me, Al, and you're already judging my cultural standing. I find that very offensive. There must be something you want. Other than a cheeseburger, a cold beer, and you shutting the hell up, I'm all good. Whatever the pay you, I'll double it. They're not paying me anything. Why are you doing this? Well, one, I'm a bad person. Two, I understand that love takes many forms. And three, most importantly, you've seen all our faces. I've made the mistake of not tying up loose ends once before. I won't tell a soul, I promise. We both know you'll go straight to the police. I won't. I fucking swear it. I could give you ten thousand dollars right now. Well, here we are, Al. Curtains up. It's time for your final scene. Oh, oh God! Dead! Dead! You fucking psycho! Jock, we've been worried sick! I regret to report the sad passing of Mr. Eldonopoly. Train accident. Very sudden. I love that man! We will remember him always! The way he was on TV, before we met him. Not that any of us met him, of course. You two enjoy the rest of your vacation. <laughs>